Are you wondering how to install Ubuntu in a virtual box? Let's right away dive into a step-by-step -step guide on installing Ubuntu in a virtual box. So guys, first things first, we need the Ubuntu ISO file. So we go to the browser and just search download ubuntu first link will take you to the official website so guys this is the latest version this is a long term support version so let's just download this started downloading here meanwhile we also need the virtual box so guys if you have already downloaded these you can skip to this timestamp here so yeah let's get right into getting the virtual box just go virtual box the first link is the official this thing obviously and then just go to downloads and as usual there'll be a windows host package version and it's downloading that so let's wait for this to download so guys meanwhile we can just install the virtual box if you guys haven't so here's the regular steps just next next yes install finish and fire up the virtual box okay so the download has complete and once you've fired up your virtual box we can just click on new and here we can name it to 24 this is the 24 edition and if you want you can select the folder where this VM will be created in so now next select the ISO file you can either select it now or later but it'll be easier to just do it from here itself so I'm just gonna click on this and this is the ISO file from the download folder and click on open and then it will automatically select the rest after selecting the ISO file okay let's just stick on skip unintended installations and click on next and now this is the memory allotment for the os virtual machine so we i have 16 gb so i'm just gonna make it at least up to 4 gb but it is recommended at least your pc should have 8 gb ram and obviously 2 gb allotted for this virtual machine and the thing is that i have 16 cpus which means 8 core 16 threads i'm gonna allot up to 2 cores which is 4 threads and it is also recommended that you at least have a i5 or a ryzen 5 with at least 4 cores which will give you a better performance but below that would have more lags in your pc so be aware and don't allot more than the green line obviously so next next here it, it is the amount of space you're gonna allot for this drive i'm just gonna leave it at 25 gb next and then this is a summary of the stuff you have allotted and just check and just click on finish so here we've just created an environment for this to run but we have not yet installed Ubuntu inside this virtual machine. So we're just gonna fire it up by clicking start and then now after this comes up the installation starts. So after firing it up we can just click on try and install Ubuntu and just wait for it to load. It'll take a while for the Ubuntu OS to load up. So guys, Ubuntu installation window has popped up, so obviously English and then we click on next. So accessibilities, customize, uh, we can just do it later if you want. We'll go one by one through this English and then use wired network. So install Ubuntu. If you want you can try it out and then click on install again and do the same steps interactive installation which is the easier one and then default i am as of now not wanting to install this so we can click on next 
so we're installing it in a vm so we don't need to worry about this it's gonna be erase disk in install ubuntu and then your computer your name okay, tech tech rovers let it let this be so vm don't need to worry about the safety you can keep any password you want it's your wish next location is india mumbai choose your location guys and the summary we click on install it's gonna take a couple of minutes so we'll wait until this finish installing so guys it has finished installing now we can just click on restart now we're gonna boot back into the installed Ubuntu and here we go we got into the Ubuntu just put your password you entered while creating we are in in Ubuntu Ubuntu 2024 LTS version and just go through these welcome stuff click on enter no you see we don't want to share our data finish so this is the ubuntu we we'll just go to settings so we got this is the system name ubuntu 24.04 lts so this is it guys this is how you can install ubuntu into a virtual box and thanks for watching see you in the next video